you were safe for a while. You built up a small, livable existence. But now, Moloch has returned. Fighting together against him may be your only hope. We add a phase. Instructions don't look extremely that difficult. For this and Ignacy announced it earlier this year. Security breaker, got a new symbol. Ooh, Panzer truck. Captured scanner. High tech seller. Retrieve Kasparov. Ma caged mutant. Mutant necrosby. Augmentations, excess care packs, heavy caravan. Each time you destroy a machine, gain a token, nice. Some features. Looks like a lot of distance ones, some twos. Nice, there's supposed to be 50 cards here. got the promo which is this card the server room the lock server room and the hacked server room each player receives five ammo for each following around deploy one fewer machine Why hack the machines when you can go straight to the source? Hack the Moloch server room to slow down the onslaught of Moloch forces. During the setup, place a Moloch server room in the middle of the play area. Each time you hack a machine, instead of taking it into your hand, you may place a gear onto the server room. The hack card is placed into the machine discard pile. Once you have placed a number of gears onto the server room equal to the number of players plus one, it is hacked and flipped over. Nice. All right. So that is the unboxing of Moloch. I hope you enjoy it. As I was sleeving these, 
I realized that there are some cards that are two-sided. So here we have the robots, and then here we have the reward for beating them. I'll see if my, yeah, okay, my sleeves don't interfere too much. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three robots, and that makes sense because we also have twenty-seven of these. Now, from my quick reading of the rules, what happens is these twenty-seven get shuffled into the deck like any expansion but you can only use it with the base deck so Moloch is a separate expansion and since the rule specifically said the difficulty for one player I'm going to assume that a solo mode is possible so we'll give that a try I'll play through it a couple times see how it works and then make a video about it Here's the conductor. That means it's time to go. If you enjoyed the video, leave me a like and a comment. Until next time, have fun training.